So here we are on Linux Mint inside of a virtual machine, of course, installing it onto my Asus laptop. And keeps falling asleep. So we're going to do the install and then come back. Mm hmm okay Linux Mint 18 has booted up so we're gonna close that up then we're gonna go to our desktop settings mm hmm mm hmm guess that's not going to work. Maybe our regular settings. Having never used this before, we'll have to figure this out. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Hmm. Uh -huh. uh. Well, it's all new. Remember, folks, I'm as new to this as you might be. Hmm. Hmm. We're going to try typing in display. Sorry about the camera. Did play is not going to work. Ah, here we go. Hopefully. Oh, yes. And we're going to use 1360 by whatever. And hit apply. I'm going to say keep and go to full screen. <clears throat> and then close it. Well, by golly, that looks pretty damn decent. Now, we're going to need. A decent background. Hmm. Not. Hmm. Well, we got all kinds of cool stuff coming up. Hmm. We're going to go with full moon. Yeah, full moon looks good. And settings. Yeah. And zoom. Yeah, that's good. All right. So there you have it, folks. We're all set up here. Kaboom. Uh, ignore the uh, alien vehicle. 
up here. That is not a Martian, that's my light in the house. I'm doing the best I can using a telephone to do video. So, next step. I don't like Mozilla. I want Chrome. So I'm going to go ahead and figure out how to install that and I shall return. So here we are installing updates. Looks like there's like 96 of them. Hmm. There we go. This is considerably slower than uh, Linux Lite 3.0, but still a pretty decent operating system. Remember, I'm running it in a virtual machine, and I've only set aside 1.7 gig out of 4. If you were to put this on an old computer that had 4 gig, boom! Like an old Vista machine that won't take Windows 7, this will work. Although, to be honest, I prefer Linux Lite. But that's neither here nor there. Bottom line is, it's all installed. I got Chromium on here already. We're using Google Chrome in the background there. Uh, let's see. We're going to minimize all that. And we're going to go over here to... Uh, Tablet server. Yeah, if I could type this would be very cool. Yeah. Uh, didn't want to do that. Yeah. Yeah. I have no idea what happened there. Bugger thing. Close that. Go back to here. Mm hmm. And There we go, tab the server dot com or hit enter. And just like in your Windows box. There we go. Okay, as far as I'm concerned, this is a viable alternative, especially if you have Windows Vista and you just can't get Windows 7 or 10 to run on it. Or don't want to pay for them. This is free. My recommendation is still. Uh, Linux Lite 3.0. But it'll do it for tonight. Bye.